Hey, what's up, my tactical YouTube homies? Um, just doing a quick video here. Um, not like a guar guar quick video or uh, Armory Channel quick video. You know, it takes an hour and a half. I'm just kidding, guys. You guys are cool. Um, just coming to do a quick little bear review, a little tactical fucking bear review. Um, you don't really see too many of them on YouTube, or maybe I don't search for them or whatever. But uh, real quick, I, I picked up a couple different ones here. Um, one of them I really like. One of them's eh, kind of shitty. Um, anyway, first one I have here is from Boulder Beer Company, Boulder, Colorado. It's a uh, whatever the hell this camera works. Sweaty Betty, Sweaty Betty Blonde. Um, real quick, yeah, irresistible, yada yada yada. Golden appearance, reflects a smooth and light, friendly character. Sweaty Betty Blonde is the only wheat bold enough. I don't know, some crap. So it's a wheat beer. It's unfiltered. It's got a little schmeg on the bottom. Um, so we'll go ahead and see what it's got here. My tactical bottle opener. So, uh, I can't see that shit. Anyway. Let's see what we got. Beautiful. Look like that. Sweaty Betty. Oh, oh, oh. There it is. It's kind of, uh, I don't know. It's kind of pale. I'd say if like Sam Adams, White Ale, their spring thing, fucked and had a kid with Rolling Rock, you might call it Sweaty Betty. Um, not really the best thing I ever had. Actually, it really does taste quite a bit like Rolling Rock. It's a little, uh, got a little more substance than Rolling Rock though, a little more, uh, a little more taste to it, um, but that whole kind of rolling rock taste. Um, finish is kind of clean, ain't no bad. It's pretty good. Um, what else does this fucking bottle say? Yeah, wheat beer with a wild side. Yeah, wild tastes like crap. Uh, that's about it. Doesn't really say anything else here on the bottle. The bottle's kind of shitty. Can't really see any of the uh, schmegma on the bottom there. So it's pretty good. I like uh, I like beer, most beer, all beer. Uh, there's really nothing I don't like. Um, I prefer other beer. Guinness probably has to be my favorite. Um, not huge on regular Sam Adams, Boston Lager. Boston Ale is good. Um, big fan of uh, darker beers. I like IPAs. I like uh, real ales. I like everything. So, um, shit. I find myself drinking like Pabst Blue Ribbon and Highlight the most. So, you know, that's just kind of a poor fuck. But anyway. Uh, Uh, that was kind of gay. Uh, uh, on to my second one here. Uh, this one's got floating shit in it, too. Anyway, this is from Victory. Victory Brewing out of Downingtown, Downingtown Pennsylvania. Um, pretty much like every single one of their beers. They're pretty good. This one here is Hop Devil IPA. Um, it's real good. It's real hoppy, um, but it's clean. It's uh, crisp. Uh, let's see, 6.7% alcohol. Um, I don't know. If you like IPAs, this is really good. kind of reminds me of Dogfish Head, like a 60-minute. Um, just a little different. Not a, I don't think quite as sweet as 60-minute, but we'll try this one out here. It's a little left. 
All right. Here's what we got. It's kind of nice. I'd say it's a uh, amberish color. It smells poppy. A nice head on it. Who doesn't love a nice head? Um, got it in my trusty Celtics glass. Go Celtics. Fuck LeBron. All right. You're a douchebag. Um, that's good stuff. Uh, now, if you like hoppy stuff and you like IPAs, um, this is good. People that like Dogfish Head, um, 60 minute or 90 minute, actually, you know, both of them will know what I'm talking about. It's real hoppy, but it, it's crisp and clean. Uh, there's no real aftertaste. I'd say less than a regular Sam Adams. Um, but it's good. It's got a little kick in the balls to it, you know, a little bit more than a regular beer. Um, I'm going to try to find it around here, some more victories, and, and bring them to you. Um, anyone that's around, you know, New England, you should try them out. They're awesome. Golden Monkey they make is, is amazing. It's a, a tripel, I believe it is. Um, it's real good. It's uh, light, crisp, like 10 fucking percent alcohol. It's crazy. Uh, it's expensive, but it's really good. So I'm going to go wash this beer and watch where that fuckhead LeBron's going. And uh, hopefully get some more beers to... Uh, Bring you some tactical reviewing, and uh, I got to get around to doing some more of my guns, and I don't know, find some shit around the house to review. I don't know, lawnmower or something. Who knows? Um, but cheers, happy drinking.